Okay, it's happening. Everybody stay calm. What's the procedure, everyone? What's the procedure? Stay, What's the procedure? stay calm! Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait. Hey guys, how's it going? It's Money Manny with HTX TV coming at you with this awesome cryptocurrency updates and information today. If you're not subscribed, definitely don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and don't, don't forget to hit the notification bell and don't forget to smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm. All right, here we go. <coughs> oh my God, it's up. Woo! Oh. Oh no, it's going down. Oh my gosh. All right, so we got Bitcoin coming in at a uh, little gnat or fly. <laughs> uh, Bitcoin coming in at $33,468. That's at a 2% increase in the green. Ethereum at $2,130, uh, down point, um, 0.11% in the red. Um, XRP coming in at 63 cents. Dollar increase in the green. Bitcoin Cash, $502. That's a 1% increase in the green. EOS coming in at $4.23. Over 16% increase on the day. Um, Dogecoin coming in at 22 cents. 4% uh, increase in the green. And... Last but not least, we got Shiba Coin still coming in at, yeah, we got 0 0.00008604, um, I believe, or actually, it just moved right now, not much, but uh, 7969, seven, so it's in the high sevens, kind of just holding with that Shiba swap, um, maybe in the later future things can happen, but obviously Shiba's definitely a long-term hold i'd say about five years out check it you know if you want to if you want to gamble with it and then it's your choice like i said not a financial advisor definitely long-term hold five years out <clears throat> she was swap is definitely a utility so the, the future looks bright for that so now on to some precious metals all right so we got gold coming in at 1814 dollars that's at a eight i mean Eight dollar increase in the green. Silver is at twenty six dollars and sixteen cents. A fourteen cent increase on the day in the green. Platinum one thousand one hundred nineteen dollars. That's at a twenty six dollar increase on the day. Platinum's definitely actually all metals are up today, which that's if you guys would have you know purchased any in the in the recent past, you would be happy because it's going up. Palladium is at $2,846, and that's at a $7 increase in the green. Like we say, um, always check out Precious Metals as another way to diversify your income and also have that, you know, physical um, form of currency. So now on to some um, HCMC, and um, I'm going to talk a little bit about another um, coin um penny stock as well that was mentioned in the comments recently all right guys so we got a what's up all you hcmc warriors out there wow funny thing is i buy the dip and it goes a little bit lower i was so waiting for that but it's all good it it's part of the game um still got in at a good um good lower price um today right now it's showing um hcmc's at 0 0.00090 and it is kind of down 18 percent just holding there holding strong definitely being shorted i checked out recently the the shortage volume was at like 20 percent i know in the past it was like over 40 so being at 20 percent it is still being shorted um tons of volume going through it though yeah, tons and tons of volume. The yeah revenue, you know, this last March the revenue was over three three point four. Um, and not excuse me, March. Yeah, it showed it's showing March. Let me actually look. Um, 
Yeah. Oh, quarterly. You know, quarterly. Their last quarter, they had three point four seven million dollars. So they're they're doing revenue. They're doing some things. Um, obviously, we know they're definitely expanding with the Q cups now. So that's uh, what do you call that? Like a quadruple, a five threat, something like that. Um, yeah, with their you know their patents, their you know, grocery market, vaping, Q cups. You know all their all their different avenues they're doing. Um, plus, going into different markets like Colorado and Canada. Canada, yeah, I looked at it the other day to to make sure. So Canada, they're saying it is like a four billion dollar market for the Q cups in general. But they said this year it can it could go to a five billion dollar market. So the fact that they get they're getting in there right now is actually pretty huge and good as well. So. Um, wow, point point is actually point zero 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 nine. Wow, eighteen percent. Good lord. So it went down another zero. So or it went down one point below, one point below ten. Um, so yeah, day day range showing uh point zero 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 nine zero to point zero zero one. Or yeah, zero zero one zero. Oh yeah, oh oh zero 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 nine to zero zero ten. So market cap right now showing three hundred and seven million dollars. So volume, volume still way up one point eight billion dollars in volume. That's that's huge, guys. Still a still a definitely great long term stock. Um. Um, let me know, let me know where some of you other guys are at. I know a lot of you guys have put in the comments recently, but maybe for you guys that haven't, maybe you have a position, you've just been kind of quiet about it. No big deal. Um, uh, maybe give you this chance to put in the comments. Um, maybe you weren't, didn't have a position. Maybe you recently b bought more. Let me know if you, within the last couple of weeks, if you bought, um, bought the dip, let me know how much you bought and maybe where you increased to. Let me know some of your goals. Um, I'm finally up to over 300,000 shares, so looking, you know, look, looking really good, and and I'm staying with the budget, you know, um, I'm nothing special. Some of you guys are are, you know, doing well out there with over five, you know, one million shares and five million shares, and you know, some of you are already close to half a million shares, which is awesome as well. Anything above that is just you're just uh, what do you call it, a superstar? So, but uh, yeah, things are looking good. Um, plus with the, uh, definitely, um, here it says two days ago, supermarkets packed as HCMC residents flock to stock, flock to stock. <laughs> Pretty cool. But, um, yeah, I wanted to chat real quick also about another stock uh, in the comments. want to give a shout out to, uh, um, let me see here. It was G GW3. That's what it said on the comments. GW3, you mentioned, uh. G T E H. I actually did go over that Reese like last month, I think once. But um, yeah, I was looking at that the other day. Um, you said that was a great penny stock. Actually, that one's that was coming in at like. Uh, let me pull it up here. Yeah, it was, it was like zero point zero zero seven. Let's see if I can. I should probably just. Yeah, it's like point. Zero 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 seven, um, yeah, three zeros and then seven, seven two, something like that. And actually, it would be the highest it's ever hit was ten cents um, this last year. So, GTEH, I, basically they they make like um, vitamin supplements, protein shakes, stuff like that, with like hemp products, you know. So that's kind of the 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 gist of it. I mean, I mean, there obviously there's a lot more into it. Yeah, G T E H. Here we go. Pulled it up. Yeah, I just wanted to go and chat a little bit about G T E H. I was like, I was kind of that. Actually, was another one that I've been looking to get into as well. At the end of the day, I try to do most of the stocks that I'm involved with, but you know, it's okay. You don't have to be in every stock just to chat about it. The um, yeah, actually, today they're at zero point zero 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 eight. Um, they're up 8%. That's looking pretty good. Um, 
more than one person has mentioned it and they like it and I have looked into them and they uh, do seem like a decent company that I'm obviously anything to do with uh, fitness products and stuff like that always you know is a a good market because that's that's a huge market in the industry so I wanted to go over them real quick and market cap for them 2.3 million dollars so yeah their highest point they actually hit 10 cents within this last year so the other day they're at 0 0.00074 today they're at 0 0.00080 so their most recent news was showing let's see their most recent news pulling up on Yahoo Finance um, yeah let me see here Yeah, I don't really see anything totally recent. Uh, well, actually, here it says July 6th. They're looking to acquire unique children's supplement brand Nature Soothy. Or Na Nature Soothy. So, actually, that is recent. Excuse me. It showed three days ago, Gentech Holdings, Inc. to acquire unique children's supplement brand Nature Soothy. So, actually, that's pretty good news. So, and they're... That right now it's a good buy, so I would should I wish maybe here in the near future I'll be looking at them. Hopefully, if I do get into it, I don't get in too late, but uh, definitely that's another one to check out. GTEH, uh, uh, thanks for thanks to the viewers for mentioning, mentioning it again. I did go, I went over that like I know I did go over that like last month, so maybe I'll start following it um, closely, just like also as well. Um, yeah, so they're that's good news. It's recent and they're they're under a penny, so you could definitely buy tons of shares with that. But that's wanted to leave that info with you guys today. Whatever you do with it, you're definitely on your own. But have a good one. Um, chat with you guys soon. So definitely check out those uh, cryptos this week. Um, that's all I got for you guys today. But definitely check out your apps. Um, a lot of stuffs going on. You know, Cardano is above a dollar now. That's pretty. Awesome, good news. So, talk to you guys later. It's Money Manny with HDX TV. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Y'all have a good one. Talk to you guys later.